All right, Shalom, Shalom, good boy, praise Abba Nawa, Yahweh, Bashem, Mashah, Kevashah, Bashem, Kakadash, peace and blessings, so the blood was baptized in the covenant for the remission of sins. And today, man, I want to deal with the term Mag Hariah, right, Mag Hariah, right, which was a name of a minor Jewish sect that appeared in the first century BC. It says their special practice was the keeping of all their literature in caves in the surrounding hills in Palestine. The Mahakariya believed that God is to sublime to mingle with matter. Thus, they did not believe that God directly created the world. See that? So these type of Israelites don't believe that the Most High created the earth, right? Which these go into what Gnostic Israelites, they don't believe that the Most High directly created the earth, right? As in the Lord Yahweh Shai, they don't believe he created the earth. They believe that uh, Satan created the earth. That's why it says, but that an angel, which represents God, created the earth, which, there, which when you go into it, they're going to talk about the demerge, which goes into uh, one of Satan's wicked names and all that other nonsense. And that uh, they basically believe that Satan created the earth, man. Not the most high didn't create the earth, but an angel which represent him. Which is, uh, they say, that uh, an angel or the devil created us. Right? It says um, they did not believe that God directly created the world, which the scriptures tell you all things was made by him, <laughs> and without him was out nothing made, but that an angel which represents God created the earth. It says, see the demerge and Tahil, which I'm gonna probably look those up, which the demerge goes into Satan, man. Satan creating us, all right? Which a lot of uh, people believe, man, mainly, the one West Israelites believe their maker is Satan, man. They made their own commentaries. You hate Satan, but you believe he's your maker. It's confusion, man. They made their own commentaries on the Bible, right? <clears throat> they just be winging it. In the law, some scholars have identified the Mag Haraya as a part of the Essenes or the Therapeutae, which I don't believe that they were Essenes, all right? Because the Essenes wasn't teaching that Satan created us, man. All right, now the Therapeutes, I don't really know too much about them. It says, according to some strands of Gnosticism, the demerge is a malevolent as it is linked to the material world. In other words, including the teachings of Valentinus, the demerge is simply ignorant or... Uh, I can't see that word, but they're basically saying that um, <clears throat> the creator is evil, man. See, Gnostics, they believe Satan, right, which a lot of brothers know as Yadabo, right, which is one of his names. That's not his most holy name. I got, I got the holy name, Satan's holy name, and I haven't taught nobody but a few beloveds it, okay? All right, so his that Gnostic name that brothers is calling on Satan's Gnostic name, that's not his. That's not his heavenly holy name. <clears throat> that's not his heavenly name. Those are his names in wickedness. See, a lot of guys think Satan was created uh, evil, man. Satan wasn't created evil, just like Cain wasn't created evil. All right, just them spirits just start getting on them. And, and wicked thoughts turned them evil, man, and jealousy, all right? So Satan wasn't actually born evil. So his his righteous name, it's not his wicked name, all right? He got different names, all right? And Satan is just a name to refer to uh, his character, which is what being an adversary and an enemy, which even humans can get called Satan. So that's not... His literal name, man. Even a human can be called Satan. Herod was called Satan. See that? Is Herod's literal name Satan? No. 
uh, people you call people the uh, devil. You Jake, you would call a regular another Jake the devil. Does that mean Jake is literally named the devil? See that? So Satan's not his his original name. Y'all the both. That's not his original name. That's his Gnostic name for for him for him being wicked, man. All right. Well, his real heavenly name is definitely in the Hebrew. It's in the Hebrew, right? The heavenly, because the Hebrew language go back to the heavenly language, but the Hebrew language is not the original form of the he heavenly language. That's what people don't know. See that? It's a it's a basically a branch of the heavenly language, just like uh, there's other various languages as well that branch from the heavenly language. But the demurge is supposed to be Satan, man. Right, which you hear brothers calling them y'all to both. Was that name is 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 linked to him and being wicked, man. But Jake don't know Satan's name when Satan was righteous. See that? You don't know his name when he was righteous. Right? Which he has a few names, man. Alright. So uh yeah, they say he was ignorant. And then, you know, according to Gnosticists, they, they actually tell you Satan is Yahweh. They'll tell you Satan is Yahweh. <clears throat> I can bring that out too, man. I haven't brought it out. But according to these Gnostics, they also say that Satan is Yahweh and the God of the Old Testament is the devil. They teach the God of the Old Testament is the devil, which is complete nonsense. It says Gnosticism presents a distinction between the highest unknowable God and or supreme being and the demergic creator of the material commonly identified as Yahweh or who the brothers know as Yahweh. <laughs> right, so they say that Yahweh is not the uh he's not the supreme God basically. Right, the God of the Hebrew Bible, several systems of Gnostic thought present the demergic as an antagonistic to the will of the supreme being his act or creation occurs in an unconscious semblance so they 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 really try to shit on the heavenly uh father man all right <clears throat> which is a uh, complete wickedness man it says, the earliest Gnostic sects ascribe the work of creation to angels. See that? They wasn't quoting Ephesians where Paul said he created all things through Yahweh Shai. They're, they're saying that the angels created us, man. All right? Which they teach that Satan is your creator, man. Right? Like, like a lot of Israelites teach that. That Satan is uh, your maker, man. <clears throat> Some of them using the same passage in Genesis, right? Not knowing when the Lord said, let us make man in our image, right? He was talking about making mankind in the image of, of, uh, of him and wisdom, man. All right, wasn't talking about the angels, man. So Irenaeus tells of the system of Simon Magus, of the system of Menander, of the system of Saturninus, in which the number of these angels is reckoned as seven in the system of carpal crates and the world, da, da 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 The point, though, man, that they say that the angels is, is the uh, work of creation is of the angels, man. That's why I uh, quoted it. If y'all go back to an old video where uh, I went on, I think it's 3 Corinthians, man. In 3 Corinthians, Paul was rebuking these uh, Gnostic guys because uh Paul had to rebuke them for saying that they, the angels created the world, man. I already did a video on that a while back. So these Gnostic guys were full of shit because they claim they follow Paul, but yet teach against the doctrine that Paul taught, that the Lord Yahweh Shah was our creator. But they want to say Satan's our creator. When the Lord Yahweh Shah says Satan has nothing in him, man. This is now the Archon, which means ruler. Who is weak has three names. The first name is Yodaboth. The second is Saklas, fool, and the third is Samael, which means blind God. And he is impious, and his arrogance is in him. 
he for he said i am god and there is no other god beside me for he is ignorant so see that this is the gnostic doctrine man right these are a few names they have for the wicked one and they said he's the one that said i am god and there is no other god beside me which that they trying to call the most high the devil in the scriptures see that <clears throat> which really is bs because Satan didn't say that. That was actually the Lord Yahweh Shah that said that I am God and there is no other God beside me. That's really talking about Yahweh Shah because when Yahweh Shah created us, he didn't, he didn't get no help from another God to create us. That's why the new covenant tell you that the Lord Yahweh Shah is our creator. Right? That's why I said that there is no other God beside me because he didn't need no other God to help him create us, man. He used a goddess, which is a wisdom, not a god, which would have been another male power. All right? So that's what it is, man. They're, they're basically talking shit against Yahweh Shah and, and calling Yahweh Shah the devil. It says he is the merge and maker of man. So they're saying that uh, Satan is your maker, man. This is why you have what Israelites that believe that the devil helped create us. It says he is the merge and maker of man, but as a ray of light from above enters the body of man and gives him a soul. So they're saying Satan is the one that gave you a body and soul, man. And they also call Satan uh, Yahweh or Yahweh. This is even why GLCC is a, a Gnostic uh, section of Israelites because they call Yah the devil. And that's what all the Gnostic people do that, man. Right? Which a lot of, uh, you know, brothers is coming into that Gnostic knowledge, but they don't really know that, man. Because the, a lot of those Gnostic people teach that uh, Yah is the devil, just like GLCC. It says, Yah the Booth is filled with envy. He tries to limit man's knowledge by forbidding him. See that? And that's the name you hear, you know, brothers ringing out, which, uh, you know, another name for, for the wicked one, the father of lies. It says he tries to limit man's knowledge by forbidding him the fruit of knowledge in paradise. See that? At the consummation of all things, all light will return to the Roma. But y'all are both to demerge with... Uh, the material world will be cast into the lower depths. All right, which that's that's true. He's definitely going to to uh, torment now. All right, according to prophecy of the scriptures, not according to my own interpretation. Okay, but they say he's the one that is our maker. He's our maker, but he's getting sent to hell. Come on now. <laughs> oh, my God. And Pistis Sophia, Yaldabaoth, has already sunk from his highest estate and resides in chaos. Right, which uh, the scriptures do say, Woe to the inhabitants of the earth, for the devils come down, having great wrath, because he knows time is short. Right, the demon said, Are you coming to torment us before the time? All right, it says he has already sunk from his highest state and resides in chaos, where with his 49 demons, he tortures wicked souls and boiling rivers of pitch and with other punishments. He is an archon with the face of a lion and half flame and half darkness. Okay, so he's a, he's a demon, man. All right. But that's not... That's not the hit, one of his hidden names. Because the, the Gnostics not pushing. I'm going to just keep it all the way up, honey, with you, beloveds. The Gnostics are not pushing his 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 most holy name. All right? They don't know it. All right? They're not pushing none of the gods' holy, holy, holy of names. They're pushing Satan's the demon names, man. Because <clears throat> they don't really know. They don't know uh, 
everything, man. They know a little bit of stuff, but they don't know everything, man. And they, they, they still need to be retaught some shit, too. A lot of these Gnostic people, man. <clears throat> In many Gnostic systems, the Aeons are the various emanations of the superior god or monad. Beginning in certain Gnostic texts with the Hermaphroditic her Aeon Barbalo. See that? They're calling Barbalo a Hermaphrodite, man. That's not good, man. That's not the spirit of the Lord, man. That's not the spirit of wisdom. The Lord Yahweh Shah never called wisdom a Hermaphrodite. He always referred to as a her. See that? So these Gnostics are blaspheming the Holy Spirit, man. Referring to the Holy Spirit as a Hermaphrodite. Right? Which is confusion, man. All right? The Holy Spirit is not a, a being that's a Hermaphrodite. They're, the Holy Spirit is the Allah man, or what you call the Elohim. And in part of the Elohim, it has what? God and goddesses, man. God and goddesses, man. All right, so they make Barbalo a male and a female. See that? And that's not good, man. And that's why I, I can't accept this, man. Okay? Often in male and female. See that now, if they would have just referred to Barbalo as being a her, I'd have been cool with that. See that? Because people try to make the Holy Spirit like it's a separate, like uh, the Most High is not the Holy Spirit, which the Most High, Yahweh Shah's Father, He is the Holiest Spirit. And then you have what? Wisdom. Okay, which Barbalo is supposed to be, supposed to be wisdom, and and the mother, but they would try to twist it and call Barbalo a he as well, which is that's where they lose the beloved one, man. That's where you lost me, man. Calling uh, the heavenly mother or her or Mephodike, man. Ain't nothing holy about that, man. Or heavenly.